What's going on everyone? My name's Roscoe and welcome to the channel. We're gonna take an early look at an upcoming Pharrell Solar Glide Hue. Now this colorway, they're calling it yellow. I kind of wonder why. <laughs> but I'm not sure if my camera is going to do this colorway any justice. It is extremely bright. I would say this is more of like a sunflower yellow, which is kind of cool. And it has different shades of yellow, which I didn't know till I got this shoe in hand. So the boost is full on yellow. I've never seen a full on yellow boost, which is different. Uh, that colorway is more of like a mustard yellow so it's a little bit of a darker shade and then you have some tones of this highlighter yellow which really make the shoe pop especially here on the side and then also the laces you can tell from the video like just through the screen that the laces really pop off the shoe and so is the bottom bottom is the same color as the laces so this sneaker is set to release on august 31st for a retail price of 150 dollars now this colorway is part of a pack there's a red a royal blue and also a purple pair as well which is kind of crazy because they just released a tonal pack with these solar glide hues and now they just flipped the switch and went with a full-on bright color pack which is insane and i've been seeing pharrell wear this sneaker for months now really wanted to get my hands on it these are so sick i've always said here on the channel that the solar glide hue is so underrated it's only 150 bucks and it reminds me of an ultra boost as far as comfort as far as the feel i mean you can't go wrong with this shoe at all it's just that there's no hype on it which i totally understand i think with pharrell sneakers everyone kind of goes towards the nmds uh, maybe the colorways haven't been right i mean the tonal pack with the gray the black and the white and the cream I mean, those colors really don't pop, so I can understand them sitting. Like I said, it reminds me of an Ultra Boost with a full length boost and also the heel cap here on the side. Uh, and then you have the hue embroidered here on the toe box, which is we've seen in all Pharrell sneakers. It's iconic. The only thing I do wish he did change it up on this shoe, change up the embroidery. I have a pair of the Japan a uh, human made blue heart on it, which I absolutely love. For some other logo, I think this shoe would sell out instantly. That's my only like gripe against this shoe, but for 150 bucks, I mean, these things are fire. Throw some shorts, some high socks. People will be seeing you from a mile, a mile away with these things on. Do I think these shoes will sell out? Uh, probably not. I don't think Pharrell has much hype around it anymore. And I think they're gonna make a good amount of pairs. So I think if you want a pair, you're gonna easily be able to get one. <laughs> I bought these to rock. Uh, these are absolutely fire. I like them a lot. I, you know, you don't see a yellow sneaker like this that often. Luckily enough, I was able to get these early from my good friend Souls for Less. Put his Instagram handle down below. Make sure you guys go check out Souls for Less. Absolutely fire. But guys, let me know if this sneaker is a cop or a drop or if you're interested in any other colorway, I might be checking out red, because you don't really see an all red Adidas sneaker. I mean, we've been waiting for it, yay. It doesn't look like they're gonna do it anytime soon. And if you did enjoy the video, go ahead and smash that like button for me, and subscribe to the channel. And like always, I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.